Okay, you real cool, be okay. <laughs> if you went around the whole country, what you doing? <laughs> or like, you know, you know how I feel about you, babe. Mm. Oh my god. Welcome back to my channel. How you guys doing? It's been a minute. I know. I've been gone for three months. I'm so sorry. I've been moving. There was Ramadan. I was trying to be respectful for people, you know what I mean? And plus, I like drinking on TV, so it's, <laughs> it's a little problem. So, I've been gone for like about three months, almost, I think. Yeah, I was trying to figure out myself a little bit. But anyways, we're about to do a tipsy girl top. You know how I am. I love this. Yes. This is my favorite. <laughs> I'm gonna put, introduce you guys to my beautiful, lovely ladies, my friends. Hello. So I'm gonna go with a Barb. I call her a Barb. But her name is Barbara. Barbara yes. Her Instagram stuff right here, <laughs> anywhere. And I'm gonna put her down below as well if you guys wanna, you know, check her out. Follow me, you know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, follow me, don't stop me, but follow me. You know? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> Do not stalk her. You hey boys, calm down. Just yes. a little bit, just a little bit. Yes. This is my friend Christina. Yes. She has a YouTube channel. I'm about to link it down below as well. You guys check her out. She is cute. She got a really beautiful hair. Like, look at that curliness. No, honestly, like, like, like isn't it? Let me take a minute. Okay. Hi. She got the beautiful curly hair and she got the flawless skin. Yes. Like, oh, I got beautiful friends right next to me. We are. Honey. gorgeous. Yeah. <laughs> just, just a little bit, you know? We're about to have a topic. I don't know if we want to do it, but we, you know, we gotta, we gotta talk about something. I'm back. So I have to talk about something. Mm. Oh boys though. Mm. Oh. How we feel about them? Oh mm. Do we even know what we feel like? My skin is boiling. <laughs> Lord have mercy. We're gonna, we're gonna decode them a little bit. Just a little bit. What they mean. Yeah. What they say. What they mean when they say it. We're gonna have a little hookah. We're gonna have a little wine. We're gonna get it right. All tight, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Let's get right to the topic. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna drink my wine real quick because you know, I mean, y'all wanna take a sip, y'all. Yeah, 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 I think it's a break. See, girl talk, we talk about the wines we drink. Mm. So this is called so good. La Dua so good. Emperor Nana? Mm -hmm. Get yourself one, okay? Yes. 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 It's really good. Let's go to the first one. <clears throat> Has anybody ever, between us three, had a guy say, Let's chill in the car, it's too hot or cold outside? Oh God. Girl. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> yes. You want us to have it? Who has it? Right? It's too cold. <clears throat> it's too cold. <laughs> it's too cold. <laughs> I mean, it was the summertime, so mm -hmm. I'm not a fan of the heat, so I like the cold a little bit. And so I literally met him, like, right on the spot. He's like, you know what? Are, are you hot? You want to sit in my car? We just talk for a while. I was like, oh, okay, you real cool. Okay. And I said, oh, yes, yeah, because I'm hot. Like, I'm, you know, I'm sweating over yeah, here. Yeah, you need the AC on. Turn it off. So we it's started the car, and, you know, and then it just kind of went from there. That is definitely a move that they do. Yes, they do. I'm telling you right now, <laughs> if you hear that, you are being played. And I've been winter since she's in summer. Okay. Yeah. She was like, well, I'm about to pull up. Uh, oh. And I was like, well, I'm hungry. Oh, right, like, well, okay. We can stay in the car and talk. Come on. Oh. After we eat. I'm like, okay. I'm sitting there talking. And he's like, bleeding the seat all the way back. <laughs> you know, and that's it. Like, so you get a wrap. And they bring it all the way. What do you want? They're like, what they want? What do you want? Right? Okay. Right? okay. okay. Oh. Do you want to sit with me? Oh. <laughs> Mine was the same way. Like, I just didn't want to go home. My old yeah. car, like I, it was in the middle time. Yeah. Well. Like I didn't want to go home. Me and him, we literally parked somewhere in the middle of the blizzard. I was scared that car was gonna die that same day. <laughs> all right, like we just we cranked it all the way for the heat, like to be everywhere, and yeah. then he was just like, "What's up?" And I'm just looking at him like, "That's uh, fuckboy behavior." Yeah. You know? yeah. Like, "What's up?" But okay, let me translate what that means, though, so you girls can understand. <laughs> it just means the guy is just. Desperate, okay. Oh, wanting to make out with you, mm -hmm. but they don't want to go outside, mm -hmm. and they don't want to oh. get caught. Yeah. They don't want to get caught by anybody Listen in their own place. You know what I'm saying? Listen to this one. That's what the translation means. Oh, I gotta turn the AC on. This shit is hot. I'm hot. <laughs> 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 Put my Corona thing off. Yeah, it's Corona. Yeah. Okay. Corona. Coronavirus. <laughs> it's real out here. It's okay. They be saying, I want to spend time, a quality time with you, but they want to go to some nice, quiet right, place right, right. and alone. Right. Does anybody have that? Anybody, anybody I mean, got full about that? Because I know I did. It depends though, because for me, I do like quality time, right? So if you and I are on the same vibe where I can understand like, okay, you obviously are looking for something and I'm looking for something, or we're just trying to have a, a chill night. I'm down to like, you know, hang out with you, do something chill, like spend time together, yeah. watch a movie okay. or like, 
go out, grab something to eat, come back, and, you know, eat as we talk and we laugh and we watch something funny. I feel like it depends on the person that you're with. Like, if this guy is obviously someone that you don't know that well mm -hmm. and you're getting to know, then there's potential for him to be a fuckboy. If he's, like, interested in you or he's pursuing you, then that's a little different, you know, because I'm like, okay, you want to spend time with me, cool. Obviously, in that space, as a woman, like, you should have control over whatever you want to do, what you don't want to do. For example, if you know what you want to do in that situation, if you mm -hmm. want something casual, if you want a serious relationship, then you decide if you want to know want to do what you gotta do but i would say the same thing it depends it depends on the situation and then it depends on the dude yeah. you have control over the quality time, time. And exactly where it is. if you know exactly. they be like okay come to my place right you know what's gonna happen time. that is no well, problem right. you're gonna be on the game or yes exactly yeah. but one time there was a guy that said come over my place and let's spend quality time but he had his homies and his friends, like he was literally throwing a party, and I was sitting there looking at him Wait like, "Where's the quality time?" And right, like, my nigga, my nigga. Wait. Like I'm looking for the quality me. time. Did it leave me? Did it leave the door? Like, like I, did it leave before I got here? Like, yeah, oh, like I'm so confused. Did he tell you that he had his friends over, or you just showed up and you found out? I found out. I literally just found out. He didn't even, not even inform me. Literally, I, he was like, "This is the address. Come here." Were the other girls there? Yes. Oh, hell no. That was like a whole little get together. Oh, I don't know who he was messing with. Right. But some of the girls, when I walked through that door, some of the girls would be giving me a little look, and I'm just like, That's how I they're like, oh, competition is through the door. Huh? I didn't, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not competition, no. I mean, I was like, Me, The word happened to the quality time. Right. Am I speaking the same language as you? No, okay. No, I've had that happen to me. Let's be serious. We weren't together or anything. Yeah. There was like mutual understanding that he liked me and I liked him. But then, because he's a fuckboy. <laughs> he had a birthday party or whatever. Okay. So obviously I was invited because I mean, come on now. <laughs> I come and obviously I see the other girl that I, I know of. You know, it's funny because she thinks that I don't know. I didn't know about her, but obviously I knew about her. But Should I draw back? You literally went there and you seen the other girl he was messing with? Yes, as well. She was actually there as well. Wow. Oh, nigga. I was like, I'm gonna take my time to get there because you know, it's a party. I'm not gonna show up mm -hmm. right on time. Like, I'm not doing that. I know it's your birthday party, but I'm gonna I'm come at my own time. But I come and she's already there. Mm -hmm. Her friend. But she's just doing the absolute most. I'm like, sis, you look desperate. Just stop. Like, you look desperate. And like, I'm all about women and supporting them, but like, I'm empowering. I mean, why did I just do this? It's not right. like, like right. I'm right. right. <laughs> not mad at her. I was mad at him because it's like, how are you gonna bring me here when she's here? Okay. You know, have some respect. Like yeah. nobody should be really competing with a yeah, guy's exactly. attention. I'm like this, no, I will never. It. It's not worth it. You can you definitely all that, just all that attention. All the deal with okay. guys. I'm just it's like looking at them like what what part of the jeans did you not get what of the mean? woman of the like you should have literally, literally like, you like, should have got what that's like, what did, right, right. okay so the next one it says nice day at a hotel question okay. mark mm -hmm. would be fun with no one around would be chilling basically okay so he invites you over to a hotel yeah so okay. what does that what does that mean to you because like, like you, you, <laughs> you, <laughs> you put a blast oh my gosh straight blast go ahead you put all your shame oh like Cause okay. you gonna answer that? Cause like I don't know how to answer that. Mm -hmm. I never had that. So I met this guy. We knew each other for like two years. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Oh my god. He never invited me to his place. Mm. He went out all the time. <laughs> Not once. Did he pay for everything though? Yeah. Okay, then yeah, that's a little bit of it. <laughs> exactly. Don't judge by the Okay. He had a roommate okay. that had a kid and oh. a girlfriend. That's a oh, lot. That's a lot. Oh. Okay. Well, you gotta find yourself a man who has a penthouse and that's all you need. Right. Literally. Right. I'm outside here. Don't worry. Right. Like, like, all the time. Ring. 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 I'm here. He was like, well, today um, I'm gonna book a, a three day room. Okay. He's like, you can go to work from the hotel because you have to work on the yeah. I'm getting more so for me. You can go over okay. and chill or spend money or whatever. Yeah. Okay. So I'm like, all right. I don't know why I feel for it. Whatever. Cause I caught out that whole weekend. Oh! You left work? You had to put your parties aside for a guy? I mean, because I, I don't know. Before, I if I'm invested in You somebody, have? I don't know. I'm, I'm invested in somebody I would really call out. Yeah. Because I want to spend time with you. Oh. Oh. Meanwhile, you like, he got a king room. Mm -hmm. So he's sitting in the chair. Mm -hmm. Watching the TV, the basketball game. I'm sitting on the bed. Yeah, I was just thrown off. Like you got a whole hotel room. I get that. Oh, he left you by yourself. Oh, 
And he watched the game like the whole entire time. Clink, like, clink, 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 clink. You know how like you be taunting dudes, like you want some. You yeah, taunt yeah dudes, of course. You want some. Yeah, of course. I had to taunt him like multiple times. Wow. And I, he still. No. Oh, it just wasn't worth it. Mm -hmm. um, he got you a whole hotel just to have you sit and look cute while he watches the basketball game. Did you take a, a bubble bath? Girl. Utilize that hotel? I used, utilize all the liquid drugs. Okay, good. That sure did. Good. I don't know if you guys ever had this because I have not. Guys saying I love you, but we're not getting into a relationship just yet. Oh my god. Woo! I've been in that situation. Oh my yeah. god, they're so annoying. So many, so many times. Time. Personally, for me, like I like older guys. Like I don't date anyone who's like okay. I have a couple times, obviously, but my preference is guys who are like 27, 28, 29, okay. and 30. Respect that. You would think that a guy of that age that they would want to settle down. You can tell I'm a serious person. Like, that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a relationship. I'm not looking for right. casual things. You would think that guys around that age, that they want something serious. No, they're the ones to play with you the most. No, they can manipulate you. Exactly, exactly. I was in this whole situation with this guy the whole time he had a girlfriend. The whole time. And I recently actually just found out that he had a girlfriend the entire time. My being is that he would like say certain things like, oh, you know, like I would love to get married with you. Like, you know, like you can meet my mom and all these different things. You know, things that you want to hear if you're like looking to settle down. He's like, I'm buying a house with you. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. Like, I'm looking at him like, do you really mean this stuff? Because your actions are showing me things. Exactly. You have to pay attention to the actions and the words. It has to sink. If it doesn't sink and your gut is telling you, also listen to your gut. If your gut is telling you that this guy is playing with you, he 100% mm -hmm. most of the time is all the time playing with you. Is playing with you. I just want to get to know you. Mm -hmm. Anytime you know what, like that to you. Get to know you. Bruh, no. I want to get to know you. No. That's my favorite line. That is cute that she is not, not interested, interested in you. you. Just like, get to know you. Switch it back. He just wants her. And then it's, once he gets her, he's like, okay, this is. However, if that is what you want as well, then cool, right? But I just feel like guys don't know how to be honest about themselves. Like they just want to play with you, but it's like, you can tell a girl, hey, I just want to fuck, and she can be like, I want to do the same. Exactly. Um, right? Or yeah. vice versa. Right. You can be like, I don't want to do that, so bye. Okay. Oh. But it's like, they always want to play games and play oh. around the bush oh and beat around like, the bush. Be, honest. Like, be honest. Yo, like, just tell me what you want. Exactly. I'm a human being. I can be the right. I like the fact that guys think that we're sensitive. Like, I know we are, but we're grown-ass people. Not we can word. handle. Not the we word. Can, we can handle our emotions. But if you're honest about it, fucking it asshole. Exactly. We can handle it. Like, we literally, most of us girls grew up with dudes in our lives. We grew up with oh, guys in our lives. We grew up with that. brothers. Yes. Cousins. Yes. You want to, like, sugarcoat things? No. Nah. Yeah. Irritates the crap you out know? of me. Like, talk, communication. Like, you went to school, right? At least you went to high school. You don't read, right? I don't, you don't read, right? You don't read, right? right? Honestly, you speak like, what you say. You text like, it what you me. say. But so speak, speak what you mean. Like, there are y'all to use the same line. Use the same, <laughs> same line, line with a different with guy. With a guy. With a guy. Ooh, I swear. Ooh. But see, he, he will already keep it. Like, yes. Oh, exactly. Oh, she don't she want nothing. Want if he tells you he doesn't want, he doesn't want, want nothing want, serious, that's your fault. And you keep pursuing him. That. I and love men you. like that. I really do. Yeah, I and I respect love men. That can, Please exactly. tell me you just want something casual. That's it. Yes. What he cool. Wants. So when somebody says that to you, lie, 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 obviously. Okay. When they say I love you, but we're not getting too into a relationship, mm. obviously they can, they say I obviously can't get my ass into trouble. If I get into a relationship with you, I can't fuck with the rest of the 200 girls I just made love to. He can say I love you all the fuck he wants. That word is easy to you know, say. You know what hurts the most? Do you feel it though? Yeah. It ain't that easy to feel. Yeah. <laughs> you know what hurts the most? When a guy yeah. tells you that he loves you while you guys are having sex. Oh, oh my, my god. god. You love what we're doing or you actually love me? Yeah. And that bothers me so, so much. Me yes. too. You know, because, because it misleads people. Yes. Exactly. It confuses you. Or like, you know you know how I feel about you, babe. Mm. Oh my god. You know how you feel about me? Are you I angry? Know. That's okay. Okay. Are you <laughs> sad today? Do you need a pickle? Do you, know? Do you want somebody to rub your dick? Yeah. Last one. I am sorry, I'm not able to give you time, okay? I'm busy with work slash college slash school. Hope you all understand. Who says that to people? Only fuck boys. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I work 80 hours a fucking week, my nigga, sometimes, okay? 80 hours, we work. 80 hours. And Mr. Barack Obama brings the whole country <laughs> out here. Okay, yes. you are not that busy 
fucking Woo! good. I'm so tired of hearing No, I'm sick to me too. You're I'm not that so busy. Tired. Listen, we all got shit to do. All the time. Cool. We all got shit to do. All the time. time. <laughs> if you went around the whole country, what you doing? <laughs> what you doing? What you doing? I don't care what your job is. You can be FBI, oh. CIA, DIA, so whatever. 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 the police car. Right. Let's I'm so tired <laughs> of hearing I'm busy. <sighs> Who are you busy for? Is you busy for your mom? Is you busy for another bitch? Bruh. Is you busy for your baby mom? Is you busy is. for niggas? But then I see you on, listen, I see you on Instagram <laughs> doing your business with your friends and hanging out on some rooftop doing God knows what with some. You know, so you're not that busy, honey. You just ain't prioritizing. Bring me with you. Why? I'm cool. Bring me with you. Say that. We all got cars. At this age, 2021, every fucking girl got a car. You know something wrong. If they don't, don't. If I hear that, New York City. <laughs> we all are busy. We that, all? You're just trying to tell me you're not making time for me, and that's fine. Because I'm wasting my time. You're not gonna tell me. Don't I waste my time. It. Don't hit me up two days later. You yeah. yeah. later. Okay. I don't want to talk yeah. to you at that time. I wanted to talk to you the day that I wanted to talk to you. Yeah, and if you don't want to talk to me, fuck boy, get the fuck out of my life. Get the fuck out. When they have time. They'll hit you up. Exactly. Right? When you don't have when time. When you don't have time, when you, that's when they want to be like, oh, and you want to come over. And, and, then, and you're you know, more considerate. You're, you're more considerate oh because you're like, you're literally considerate because you're a girl and you're like, okay, give me give me 20 minutes. Give me 30 minutes. I mean, 45 minutes. Right? I got you. You need to listen to your gut. You need to pay attention to those little instincts that, yes, you keep, that your body and your mind keeps telling because God is trying to tell you something. Yeah. I'm also very religious. Me too. God fear yes. was. We all are. It feels like rejection is often God's protection when you're heading in the wrong direction. So okay. God's literally God's rejection is God's, is God's protection. protection. He's protecting you guys yes. from every single thing that you are supposed go. to experience in life. Let that life person go. Because you will find somebody better. Come you were worth. No, no, you were. The most that I ever heard in my life mm -hmm. was someone told me that if you saw the person that you wanted, would they recognize you? And I was like, sure. hmm. If they saw me, would they recognize me? Because I know I want them, but if they saw me, me would they would recognize, recognize who me? I am? Exactly. And I was like, wow. So it's not just about the other person making changes. It's about you. It's, or it's not better than right self. It's That's about really you That's deep. also healing yourself and mm -hmm. getting through the things you got to get through. Because if you don't wow. do that, you can't maintain a relationship. You can't be in a relationship. Yeah, yeah, I've been and there. And you cannot love yourself. Exactly. You can't even give love back to the other person. Yeah, you can't. I, you don't know. Yes, we're talking about fuckboys. Fuckboys are such... Like they, you will go through experience when you meet fuckboys, mm -hmm. you know. But you gotta learn from that. Every yeah. lesson is a learning, learning moment. You gotta learn from that. You gotta mm -hmm. heal from those moments. Mm -hmm. I've been through a lot of fuckboys. I have. However, I'm learning to like forgive myself first of all for letting that happen because mm -hmm. you know I shouldn't let that happen. But you also gotta learn to love yourself. As uh, I think that it's all about loving yourself yeah. and knowing yeah. who you are and like being confident in your independence, being confident in your singlehood. Did you figure that out? The right guy will gravitate towards you. They'll see you be like, you know, I love the fact that you know yourself, you know mm -hmm. who you are, you're mm -hmm. steady, you're firm. Tipsy girl talk was beautiful. It was amazing. We're so tipsy guys. Yes, I'm very drunk right now. We're drunk. You can't yeah, help, but I'm very amazing. I just want to tell you guys, thank you for always supporting me. Thank you. Guys. Thank you for loving me. For inviting me. Thank you for being a shiny star. Thank Make sure you guys. subscribe to my channel. Oh, you you subscribe. subscribe to my channel. Like and comment. Comment. Like and comment. Support. The support. Yeah. Support my guys' yes. channel. Um, period. And I really so hope much. you learned something. Yes. You learned something from this. Exactly. Okay. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Love you guys. Bye.